the time when both the heavens and the earth were born, the great god Arusu came down from the heavens, and he created the great eagle and the great sea. The great eagle turned upon its creator and attacked Arusu. Arusu's fingers fell into the great sea and became the islands known as the Four Gods. It is a time before legends, and a new legend is about to begin. Macaronia was a small and insignificant country located in the Shoyo region of the continent of Hulk. Until one day, the ruins of a previous civilization were unearthed, and the technology of the once prosperous pre-culture was rediscovered. The Megaronians were quick to develop and to exploit the new technology, spawning a period of rapid development. Almost immediately, the advanced technology gave birth to a devastating, powerful new military, and King Nabusu was given teeth with which to feed his imperialist desires. However, even control of the entire continent of Hulk proved insufficient to satisfy Nabusu's desires. So, with avarice in his heart, he aimed his inexorable wave of conquest towards the four islands of God. To Noah, Shikisu, Nod, and Ija, the foundations of faith of the common people. Ganek, the theologian, opposed this move, fearing God's anger, but King Nabusu would not listen. One by one, King Nabusu eventually gained supremacy of the four islands of God. Daruku, the king of Ija and a former pirate, had protected the four islands from intruders for generations. Once King Nabusu had finally beat the Aegean nation into submission, he had Daruku and his queen Shanira executed before their followers. He then took their son Ellery as a hostage and confined him in Megaronia. Now, without a doubt, the entire world is held in the grip of Nabusu's hands. What's this? Is this, is this true? Oh, it could be, be catastrophic. Yeah. What is the matter, Lord Gannick? What disturbs you this time? Focus, no! Hmm? the worrier is saying good heavens again. I hope this time it will at least alleviate my boredom. Oh, please, your majesty. At no other time has humor been less important than right now. Behold this book! Oh, the Asian sacred text? Where did you get that, you blubbering buffoon? I told you that everything to do with those dirty, disgusting Asians must be burned! Burned! I don't even want to think about those blundering pirate peasants! Oh, 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 oh. 
a thousand pardons, your majesty, but I just wanted to help keep all the conquered commoners under control. I thought the easiest way to establish a foothold would be to make them uh, believe in that God is a true God. So I used a copy of their sacred text to help them understand. I didn't mean to disobey you. What a ludicrous pile of camel droppings. Why do you theologians always think up such blasphemous schemes? Strike down any who oppose me with a show of power. Make them pay in blood of infants and children. Show them that my power is God! <laughs> so, what is it about that sacred text, anyway? Do, do you do you remember the ancient document that was found uh, when we excavated the old ruins? The one that expounded upon the destruction of ancient Hulk. That's the one! Well, strangely enough, the same episode is written here on these very pages! Oh, so what? Statesmen just made up those ridiculous false myths to frighten people into doing their bidding. They get the commoners to do things in God's name, and they tell them that Armageddon was near. I do it all the time. No, Your Majesty, this is nothing like those writings. This is a sacred book of prophecy. Holy stuff! This is Arusa's book, and it predicts the collapse and destruction of our Megaronian kingdom! Really? Oh, oh. <laughs> How funny! <laughs> so Megaroni will be destroyed? Will fire fall from the sky? Will the earth break apart? Tell me, exactly how oh, will it happen? One person shall destroy us all! <laughs> one person? You're saying all of Megaronia's imperial ranks will be defeated by one person? <laughs> Well, Father, it's nice to see you in such a good mood for a change. Oh, Crystal! Sarah! What good timing! Come and listen to this. Gannick the Worrywart has been entertaining me with his preposterous stories. Oh, what has he been spouting about this time? Go ahead, Gannick. Mm. Open your little book and read us a fairy tale. Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> the great eagle shall roam the earth once more and blend into the darkness of the night. It will tear at Arusa's finger. The finger's ravaged screams will soon fill the dark night, and its pain and blood will be turned into anger. Soaking, Soaking deep, deep into, into the, the earth's, earth's murky, murky soil, soil. Arusa, Arusa will watch from the heavens and grieve to the spirits. From the blood-soaked soil, he shall create the Hand of Righteousness. The Hand of Righteousness shall be the fabled Chosen One, sent to us by the grace of Arusu. The Chosen One shall rise up and do battle against the Great Eagle. Hmm? <sighs> but the Chosen One shall fall. Then we shall break the seal and release the fierce ship which is drawn by the Chosen One's spell. Yet, should the Chosen One's heart turn to evil, the Earth will return to darkness. Sorry, I guess I must have been dreaming. Wait. Wipe off your tears before you go up. Otherwise, the others will have some choice words for you. Uh, um... Emma's crying! Huh? <clears throat> Emma's crying! Emma! <laughs> Stop! Aira, are you ailing? Huh? No, I was just remembering the past. But you cry when you remember, even though you aren't hurt? Well, I guess my heart hurts a little. Oh. Come on, Nira. <laughs> Hey, Black, in which direction do they lay? 
To the west! Steer her to the west, donor! Glory be! It's a merchant ship! A Macaronian merchant ship! At last! Black! Do you see any escorts with the ship? Oh. Black! Scan the horizon for any escort ships! Aye aye! What's the matter, you frightened, Aira? <sighs> of course I'm frightened. We both know that we can be beheaded if we're captured. Did she say beheaded? We'll die very quickly if we only use our muscles. Try using your head as well. <laughs> Bite me! Oh, uh, Ira! The coast is all clear! The merchant ship is on a solo voyage! Uh, crew! Stand ready! <laughs> so, Gannick, you say that a single person will destroy our mighty Megaronia unaided? Yes, Your Majesty. And furthermore, the fierce ship they describe is the very same one the ancient document says destroyed ancient hull. <laughs> so you're saying that one ship will defeat all of our fire-breathing weapons and our flying machines? Enough! I can listen to no more of this idiotic story. Be gone! Wait a minute, Father. Huh? I'm actually finding this story rather interesting. Uh, big Sister, what are you saying? Yes, what are you saying, Crystal? <laughs> what I'm saying is that I believe in the story, Father. Of course, Megaronia will never be destroyed. But I do believe in that ship. Huh? What are you saying, Crystal? Well, I've heard that across the vast ocean there lies a great nation that rivals even our Shoyo continent. If we can obtain that ship, it would be like having God's blessing. We would be able to conquer that nation quite easily. Oh. Big Sister, please stop! You're frightening me! <laughs> Lady Sarah is right! If God heard you talking like this, it would be bad! Yes, but bad for who? Father, allow me to lead a fleet of three ships to Eja. Huh? <laughs> Crystal, how I've wished you were born a boy instead of a girl. Fine, I grant you leave. Go search for that ship. <laughs> oh, Father, please stop her! Don't fret, Sarah. Crystal will triumph. Take Felcus with you. He's a good soldier. <gasps> yes, Father, he is good. However... However? There is another I'd like to bring along with me. Another? Are you saying that Felcus alone would not <sighs> suffice? I need... Ellery. Please, no! But Lady Crystal, if summer from each season, it would be like pouring fuel onto a hot fire. Bahoosh! They'll do anything to take Prince Ellery back. Anything! Oh, please, do you really think I would be that careless? No one in Egypt could be more likely to be the fabled chosen one than young Prince Ellery. As long as we have the chosen one in hand, getting the ancient ship should not be a problem. Oh, I really do wish you'd been born a boy instead of a girl. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> 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 
Are you stupid kid on him? Is she lying mating dance? <laughs> I seriously doubt we'll be able to sell our ill-gotten goods in any of these harbors. I agree. They might be recognized as stolen goods. We might have to go to Allura, even if it is a bit risky. Aye. The wind has hmm? changed. Huh? I've never smelled this one before. This tainted wind bodes evil. Mm, freak. Ah, she can be so creepy sometimes. She gives me the chills. Uh, oh, have a little uh, respect for uh, your fellow shipmates, uh, fish face. Settle down, you scummy little maggot. Huh, what does it mean? Nothing. Uh, huh? Hey, Era. We were just clipped by a fleet of Imperial Megaronian battleships. Something is definitely wrong. Hmm. We must go home. Huh? <sighs> we must go home. We must go home. The evil wind has begun to blow. <sighs> What's wrong, Mayor? We must leave, Era. We must hurry back or it will be too late. Ah, don't be such a belly aker. You know we need to get food and stuff in Allura. And until we can get the mask fixed, we can't go anywhere, you weenie. We must go, Era. I beg of you. Hey now, Mayor, Funk is right. We'll start for home as soon as we get the mast fixed. Huh? By then it will be too late. Please. <laughs> Come with me now, Mayor. Let's go down below and get some shut eye. I wonder what's troubling Mayor. She's acting so strangely. Yes, but 
I don't think Mayard's prophecies have ever been wrong before. Prince Ellery, huh? it isn't good for you to be out in the cold night air for so long. Please come back inside before you catch a chill. Shin Shin, to what port does this ship journey to? Sire... My apologies, Shin Shin. I should have known you'd be unable to answer me. <sighs> it's been a long time since I last saw the open sea. Really? And when's the last time you saw what? a woman? <gasps> Would you like to know where this ship is going? Lady Crystal. Hmm. Ellery, it seems I'm in need of your services. You need help from me. I was brought to Megaronia at the young age of three, and for more years than I can count, I've had no one who cared to listen to my thoughts or my troubles. I am a living corpse. <laughs> and you're now saying that you need the services of this worthless shell. Oh, yes, I do. Hmm? Because this very ship is headed towards Ija Island, you see. We travel to Ija? Are you so surprised? Well then, let me shock you even further. I assume you know what this is. It's it's the holy sacred text of Asia, but uh, I thought Ganek had had it burned. Uh, I'd like to try and fulfill the prophecy that's written in here. Uh, fulfill the prophecy? Yes, with you playing the role of the chosen one. <laughs> So, Ellery, how does it feel to be a living legend? What are you going to do? <laughs> you know what I'm going to do, and you'll help me whether you want to or not, young prince. After all, you're the only one living who could possibly play the part. Shiru, how's Mayor? She's sleeping. I don't see what all the big fuss is about anyway. <laughs> well, not all pirates can be as soft-hearted as you, you know. <laughs> right you are, my friend. Hey, Donor! Do you think you can salvage the main sail? Ah, uh, don't worry your pretty head. It's already taken care of. Look there. Huh? <laughs> Oh. Well, a lad after my own heart. Uh, well, they weren't using it anyway. But why in blazes do we have to set sail tonight? We've got no choice. Era told us to ship out. Era, Era, Era. Hey, rat. Hey, did I miss a meeting? When was it she was named captain of the ship anyway, Dona? Huh. That's a good question. Remind me to ask her someday. Ah, I can't believe some stupid woman is. Ah! Ow! 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 Oh, just... She rule. Don't forget that I'm a woman too. Ah, well, I yeah. Oh. <laughs> My girl Nira, never let the scoundrels put you down. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go, no skin. You've got to be kidding! These silks are top of the line! Look at this! The last shop we went to gave us twice as much as that! I used to not carry what they gave you. Look, this is a what Tyler gave you. You know what? Take! Take! Eat! Go! I'm a tired of you looking at me. Go! I am the only one. Whatever! I don't understand a word you just said, but give me one of those big rugs. Yeah, no, okay, we make a good deal. Oh. No? All right, then. Hey, which one do you want? You want the pink one over here? I got the good one. Hey, I'm washing my hands before I take it down, just for we'll you, okay? take the one oh. in the corner. Hey, which you want? Hey, this one? Hey, hey, hey this one? Hey, no, no hey, the one next hey, to make it. Make up my mind. No, Come not on, that hey, one. one. Oh, yeah, the camel. Good meat. Hey. No, the one next to it. Hey. Oh, 
Hera, we're ready to cast off. Aye, aye. Everyone, prepare to set sail for Egypt. The wind grows with each passing minute. We must hurry back. I love the smell of fire gel in the morning. Simply shameful. Hmm? I would never have thought that I would be a party to such a wasted display of power. Tisk tisk. You always did like to conserve your energy. But I have to get the Lord's attention somehow, Felgus. His attention? You can't really be serious, Crystal. <laughs> of course I am. Don't you want to play with God's little toy? God's little toy? That ship? That's right. With that ship in my command, the world will have no choice but to bow before me. A much better plan than yours, Felgus. What do you mean? Silly boy, did you really think I didn't know your little scheme? Scheme? I don't know where you got the idea I was plotting anything. You are quite mistaken. Then why do you spend all your time building that ship of yours? Please stop, Kinsari! Go! Crystal! Stand aside or you will be slain! Let me go! Let me go! Crystal! Why are you slaughtering all these innocent people? Why are you two committing these heinous crimes? Because I can. And these people are far from innocent. Their king has been long dead and their prince has been captured, yet they still live comfortably. I have no sympathy for them. Hmm. Uh, how dare you! God would unleash his mighty anger upon you! Hmm. I'm counting on it. Era, almost there. Well done. No! Huh? No! Don't go there! Leave them be! Mayor, what's the matter? Do you see something? Era! They are in the voice of the Silky Clan! We must stop them! Stop them? Who exactly are you talking about? Era! Trouble! Huh? Where do you take me? <laughs> Surely you remember the Selkie clan that hears the voice of God. The Selkie clan? Oh, Ira! Megaronian battleship! Megaronian? Crap! It's the same ones that ran us down! Nuts! Head for port! Hold on, Ira! We shouldn't risk docking with the Megaronian fleet in the harbor, right? Right! Oh! Mayor, huh? didn't you say something about the forest of the Selkie clan? Mm. Daughter, head around the island to the inlet in the back. The Selkie forest is closer from there. Aye, aye. I call upon thee, 
leader of the Selkie clan. He who hears Arusu's voice and does his bidding. Lady Cristel, add us to the throne of Megaronia, is here! Crystal, Princess of Megaronia, is here to hear the words of the Lord. Huh? <sighs> Heed my words. Arusu's voice will not reach those with blackened and sin-filled hearts. We have not the language to communicate with those who harbor evil. Then I'll use one of your wretched servants to translate for me. <laughs> what? Turn me loose! Use the voice of Ellery, who should have succeeded the throne of Eja, the god of love and battle, who unites the god of the waves, Tanoa, the god of the sea, Shikisu, and the god of thunder, Nod! Silence! It's him, Great Master Mora! to see you again, Prince Ellery. Master Mora. Enough of these sappy greetings and formalities. You know why we're here. Remove the sail from Arusu's ship and- Silence! Tarnish not the purity of this ground with that evil. No, Master Mora. I will not stop until I possess the ship of God. Uh, Arusu's ship- Possess the ship of God? The whole of creation is made up of those who have the heart of Arusu. You cannot force the Lord's acceptance. Well, then what about his great compassion? Now, done it. <gasps> oh! Are you going to let Ellery suffer, the chosen one who succeeds the throne of Eja? It's the successor to the throne, Ellery. Then he's the lost king of Eja. Master Mora, even if my physical body is tortured, my soul will remain pure. Please, you must heed Arusu's will. You speak like a true king. Well done, your majesty. Well then, I have no choice but to invoke Arusu's anger, do I? Do it. What are they going to do? Oh. Be at peace. Everything will be as God wills it to be. Done it. Right. Fire! <laughs> Stop this, Crystal! <laughs> Monsters! Uh, Lyra, don't! Can't you see we're vastly outnumbered? Well now, do you still refuse to summon the Lord's mighty ship? Shoot him too! No! Oh. Father! Huh? Mayor! 
Be sad, my child. Hear me. From this moment forward, you will be the guardian and protector of the Chosen One. But how will I do that? That will be revealed to you by God. But, Mayad, you must protect the Chosen One. High spirited, Henry, sire. Kill her as she wishes. <laughs> no, Hera! Huh? Huh? Hera! Oh. Oh. Oh.
was a time when both the heavens and the earth were born. The great god Urusu came down from the heavens. Urusu created the great eagle and the vast and unending great sea. The great eagle turned upon its creator and attacked Urusu. Urusu's fingers fell into the great sea and became the islands known as the Four Gods. Legendary ship that destroyed Ancient Hulk. So, do you still think me foolish? I have raised the ship of God. The ship of God, you say? <laughs> All I see is an archaic, rotting hunk of metal trash. Your ignorance is showing. You obviously have no idea what this means. <laughs> Done it. We're going to board that ship. Bring the fleet around to the inlet. Aye. And what do you want me to do with the pirates, my lady? There's something not right with that Aira girl. Throw the five of them in the brig. Aye. Ah, ah, ah. Get your hands off me, soldier boy! Ah. <laughs> Aira! Animals. Get off me! Uh, what? What's going on? Shiro? Uh, what is this thing? It's the turban shell monster! You stupid dummy, no shell can be this big. this. What's wrong, Flack? I think I found a door. Well, let's have a look then. <laughs> Blast! The briny depths have been coddling this one for ages. Tons of ancient treasure just waiting for us! No, it'll be guarded by ghosts and beasties and stuff! Get a grip, Yellow Belly! Can we go in, Shiro? Hmm. I'm sure that Era and the others will figure out where we've gone. All right then! towards the inlet at full speed. Mm. Aye, aye, sir. <laughs> Shh, Mayor, it's okay. Don't cry, Mayor. I've been without a family ever since I was barely able to talk. 
My father was killed in the first campaign against the Megaronian army. Yeah, mine too. Uh, those bastards! Huh? Uh, uh, when we get out of here, I'm gonna slit their slimy throats! Hey, Mayor! Can't you rile up that magic power you used before? But I... I didn't do anything. I heard my father say, protect the Chosen One, and then everything started to go black. The Chosen One, huh? Well, who's that? Oh, protect the Chosen One. Ooh, it's all slimy and nasty in here! Aye, it's like we're lost in the belly of a giant sea beast. Before. Huh? Shiro, look! Is this it? Huh? Hmm. There's a like as two pearls and an oyster. <sighs> huh? What do you want, <gasps> Shin Shin? Master Dunnett wants to see you in his quarters right away. He said it's urgent. We're on our way. Come on, then. Right. They're gone, sire. <clears throat> you mustn't stay long, Master Ellery. Well? Hurry, sire. Thank you for your help. Please, hurry. <gasps> huh? It's you! As the king of Ija, I have come to apologize. Mm. What are you talking about? I finally returned to Ija after being in prison for over ten years. But I... I was unable to do anything but stand and watch the carnage. <gasps> Did you say... So, all the islanders... <laughs> Why? What could they possibly expect to gain by slaughtering all those innocent people? Mm. Lady Crystal deliberately invoked the wrath of God to resurrect Arusu's mighty ship. The legendary ship of God? <gasps> it has been prophesized in the royal Aegean sacred text. The Chosen One will be wounded and will fall. When the Chosen One looks upon us, <sighs> we will break the seal. Releasing the fierce ship onto the earth. Huh? <gasps> what? Huh? How do you know of this passage? Because I have the same book. What? But there are only two copies of the sacred text, and they both belong to my father and mother. How could you possibly have the other one? Lana gave it to me. Every night before I went to sleep, Lana would read aloud from it. Lana? Uh, you mean the nursemaid, Lana? Nursemaid? Huh? <gasps> what are you doing down here, Shen Shen? <sighs> Nursemaid? Lana raised me from a very young child. I see. So Lana must have been... Huh? Prince Ellery, what the blazes are you doing here? <laughs> Run, Blackguard! No. <laughs> I've had enough out of you. Come on, your highness. Done it! Huh? Don't harm a young prince. Let it go. Elry still has some very important work to do, and until it's finished, he is our honored guest. And what exactly would that be? I want you to help us navigate the legendary ship of God. I won't do it, even if I did know how. Hmm. Soldier, go and fetch me that little pirate wench. Huh? What if her miserable little life depended on it? What? And bring that little blue selkie brat as well. She might just prove useful to us. Right! <laughs> 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 
Shinshin, I don't need to tell you what will happen if you do this again. No, no, my lady. What are you doing? Let me go! <laughs> Commoners. What are you doing? Pirates, the glint from the gold is distracting both of those two. Man, this thing is stuck on good! Got it! Find one, make one, you idiots! <laughs> Master Donnett, we have found the wreck of that pirate ship! What the? <gasps> Shiro! So your colleagues might still be alive. <laughs> uh, that's right! <laughs> well, it looks like they're all probably in the bottom of a shark's belly by now. <laughs> Donnett, you imbecile. Huh? If all of the others are dead, then where did those footprints come from? What footprints? 
Those footprints. Look, it's an entrance! Please stay above deck, Lady Crystal, where you'll be safe. We'll go down below and bring those filthy sewer rats back here to you. Well, then do it and be quick about it, you miserable worm. I'm anxious to find out exactly what it is that makes this ship so legendary. Yes, my lady. of half-witted selkies, go and get that pirate scum! Right! Do it! Blast it! Era! Take that, you scum! Oh, 
Oh, we must leave. It's too dangerous here. Don't be an idiot, Felkis. Do you really think that I would abandon Lady the ship Christophe. now? Enough! Huh? I will never let you gain control of this ship! <laughs> you tell him! Yeah. <laughs> Foolish girl, haven't you learned that you will never beat me? <laughs> Die! That's incredible! <laughs> now who's laughing? <laughs> This way! Hurry! Get below! Aye, aye, Shiro! Prince! Hurry! Follow me! I'm coming! Get your hands off me! No! Now what will you do, Ijin? You're going to be washed overboard! Huh? Don't worry about me! You must keep this ship from falling into Lady Crystal's hands! I understand, but I will be back for you! Come on! Open that door and bring me their heads! It's too late! We must return to the ship now! No, I will have this ship. Lady Crystal! Lord Malchus! Uh, hurry! Uh, <laughs> it's moving. At last, the ship is moving toward the final darkness. No one can stop it now! What are you plotting, Goku? <laughs> I think you know. <laughs> he too has been resurrected. <laughs> Era, what is going on here? You won't believe this, but this is a Rusu ship. Huh? God's ship? Hi! Does anyone even have any idea where this ship is headed? I don't know. Whatever the case, we've got to find a way to rescue Donor and Bunk! Sounds like someone must have declared war, huh? What the heck is that? A key. A what? <laughs> Come on, man, let's move! Let's go. Aye. That. Well, now what do we do, Pathfinder? We just can't jump overboard and swim for it. Huh? huh? Ah. You like heights? Wh what? Do you even know how to fly one of those things? I'll figure it out eventually. Oh, crap! Sounds like we're headed toward the command ship. Will we plow right through them? No. Oh, there's no way. My god, we can't stop it. It's headed straight for us. Turn port quickly. Let's see. I push this. And... Now we're running out of time. We you keep your blasted shirt on. Where was ah. I? It's no good. It's too late. 
Getting farther and farther away from Ija, and we still don't know where Aira is. Better than that, we don't know where we're going. Ah, crap! So now what are we gonna do? Well, I guess we should find a way inside this thing. You wanna go inside? We don't even know what this thing is! It's a whole lot better than dehydrating out here. Oh. <gasps> Fuck! I got you. What? Are you okay? Oh, Flack! Flack, speak to me. What the heck did you do that for? What? How was I supposed to know that you were the one in there, you moron? At least I'm not dumb enough to get captured by soldiers! Oh, no, but you were ugly enough to scare them away! Oh, yeah? Take that! Go! Matt, what's going on? Huh? Yo! Get Yo. Get <laughs> How did you get off the ship? Oh, I'm fine honest. We use that. That's awesome! It was like stealing candy from a baby. Saying things like that around here will get you hit by lightning. We're hitching a ride on the ship of God. Huh. Is this the legendary ship that Ellery was talking about? Aye. So where's this holy tub taking us, huh? I guess God forgot to tell us that. What? What are you saying? Well, you see, there's this big motor-like thing. But no one has really been able to figure it out. Hey, Donor, why don't you take a crack at it? Uh... Do you think she's dead? <laughs> what was that for? Don't say dumb stuff like that. But she's just been lying there for hours. <gasps> Donor Funk! Huh? Yo! Aira, what happened to Mayor? Well, she went into another one of those trances mm -hmm. and it hasn't moved since. Oh, somebody spank me and call me Edna! Hmm? Oh man, these puppies are solid gold! Welcome to Papa! <laughs> Hey, huh? Ah, oh, no! <laughs> what is this thing here? Ah! Yeah! Ah! Look at what is that thing? <laughs> there are a lot of unsolved mysteries around here. That's one of them. Huh? Is that it? So, you think you can figure it out? Uh, I don't know. I've never seen anything like this before. Hey, uh, what happens if I touch this thing here? Ah, oh, no, oh, sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll just put that back. Here. <laughs> oh, God. I give up. I haven't the faintest idea. I see. Well, then, I guess we'll just sit back and enjoy the ride. Elsia, hmm? Arusu's divine ship shall be controlled by the will of the Chosen One. <sighs> 
And that chosen one, Hera, is you! Me, chosen one? What are- Heed my words, Hera. If you wish to fight, pick up the sword and armor and use the powers of the gods, Shikisu, Nod, and Tanoa. If you want nothing, send Elsia back to the bottomless depths and seal it there! The power is yours! Uh, Mayard! <gasps> Mayard! Explain this to me! How could I be the chosen one? What does it mean? <sighs> Era, what happened? <gasps> Mayard! You mean you don't remember any of what you just said? What I said about what? No way! I can't be! I mean, it's just too silly! Huh? What's wrong? Why are you staring at me? Oh, so I suppose if I say stop ship, it'll stop just like that! When both the heavens and the earth were born, the great god Arusu came down from heaven. Arusu created the great eagle and the vast and unending great sea. The great eagle turned upon its creator and attacked Arusu. The fingers of Arusu fell into the great sea and became the islands known as the Four Gods. I told you something like this was going to happen! Now what are you going to do, Lady Crystal? Why are you so frightened, Gannick? We still have Prince Elry under lock and key. Besides, what harm can a captainless ship do? After all, they're only a pathetic bunch of ragged pirates, and most of them are children. Don't be so certain, my lady. That ship was responsible for the annihilation of Ancient Hulk, and rumor has it that your ship didn't do too well against it either. Pirates, you say? That bothers me. I can't believe you're siding with him. The past is gone, but certainly not forgotten, my dear. Gannick, where is that <gasps> blasted ship now? Sire, we're using all available ships to search for it, and I'm sure we'll find it soon. I suppose we'd better take precautionary measures. Post additional troops throughout all of Megaronia! Yes, sire! Oh, oh what were... Oh. Father, you've got to let me go after that ship. What are you saying? I can't possibly allow one of my daughters to be present in such a dangerous battle zone. Besides, they're Asian pirates. Pirates? Why are you so frightened by a handful of petty thieves? I am not frightened. I I don't want you thinking about that ship but anymore. Father! Is the battle starting? Yes, with that old ship. It's terrifying. Don't be so foolish. I fail to see what's so terrifying about an archaic hunk of rusting metal. While it was rotting on the ocean floor, our technology has advanced tremendously. But what if it really is Elchia, the legendary ship of Arusu? Felcus, I'm afraid that you're making an awful mistake. Oh, God. Ancient man drew from those same fears to invent a mythical, omniscient being to reassure them. God did not create man, but rather men created God. It's difficult for me to understand the way you think sometimes. All I know is that I fear losing you. I am not interested in wasting my time in a futile battle. But 
I am interested in ruling the world. I have the same book. Huh? Lana gave it to me. She always read it to me before I went to sleep at night. Just who is that girl? Uh, I'm getting sick of fish! If I eat another fish, I'm gonna turn into one! Crap! Neyra better hurry up and do something soon. She's been in there for two days, and we sure ain't going anywhere unless she gets off her butt and makes a decision. Funk, try not to be so hard on her. If some divine spirit came down and told me that I was the chosen one and it was my destiny to overthrow Megaronia, I'd be a little confused too. Yeah, well I wouldn't have to rack my brains. I mean, the answer is obvious. They killed my father and destroyed the island. It's very simple. They die. Yeah, but we only have this one ship. The Megaronian fleet would wipe us out in three shakes of a fish's fin. Oh, Flack is right! I don't want to die! So you've already given up? Are you just going to sit there like a lump and take it? Don't you want to pay those rat bastards back? Of course I do, you moron! They didn't exactly spare my parents either. Donna, what about you? Are you in or what? Uh, I don't know. Revenge doesn't sound like such a bad idea. But then again, neither does being a pirate on an incredible ship like this. Mm, don't be a smart ass. Stop gabbing and get back to work! If you don't catch something, we don't eat! Hey, Zero! We're seriously discussing our future here! Don't interrupt us! Oh, is that a fact? Well, no matter what you decide, we're doing what Era says. Ah, you have a bite me! you shut you moron! <laughs> Nira, it isn't good to stay below deck like this for so long. Yeah. I forgot to give this to you earlier. My book! I thought this went down with the rest of our pirate ship. Shiro found it right in some of the wreckage. Thank you very much, Nira. <laughs> it's good to see you smile. <laughs> so what's in that silly book? You want to know? I'll read it to you. Uh, really? <laughs> You know, Nira, when I was about your age, someone used to read to me from this very same book. But I think that was probably the last time I read it. Uh, why's that? Well, I'm not very good at reading books. Me neither. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if I can read this. <gasps> I wonder what this means. What does it say? Wait a second, Nira. A... Ra... <gasps> Era! What's the delay? Has Queen Shinera been found yet? Sire, she's carrying a heavy load, so it should be any moment now. There she is! She's getting away! Get her! Stop! Get her! The baby was thrown into the sea along with its mother. There's no way. Era, the child of King Daruku and Queen Shinera, sister to Prince Ellery. Sister to Prince Ellery? Era, what's going on? I'm scared. Nira, tell everyone to meet me in the engine room and tell them to hurry. Right. No! What's going on? <laughs> Era, so you've decided. After we have gathered the power of the gods from the islands Shikisu, Nod, and Tanoa, we will rescue my brother Prince Ellery and declare war against the Megaronian Empire. Ellery's your brother? Then Era is our long lost queen! <laughs> <Yeah! laughs> Alright! Let's go show those Megaronians who's boss! Yeah! Those who pollute 
The islands of the gods will invoke the wrath of our <laughs> All right, Father? I heard you cry out. Sarah! Did you have a nightmare? You look very pale. It's nothing. Gannock, where in blazes are you? Oh, here I am, Your Majesty. What are your wishes? Have you found anything out yet about that Asian pirate girl like I ordered you to? Oh, sire, at this very moment, Goku, our most renowned prophet, is working on it. So please be patient. Tell him to hurry. I have a feeling that we're in terrible trouble, even worse than we ever imagined. Just what exactly is it that you're so afraid of, Father? What is it about that pirate wench that disturbs you so? Ganek, tell that prophet of yours to hurry! Yes, sir! <laughs> I think it's about time you told me what's going on. Uh, you'll know soon enough. I beseech thee, great God of Hulk, hear my prayer and answer me, your humble servant. Does the daughter of King Daruku and Queen Shinera live? Is she a threat to the sacred kingdom? Please, reveal this to me. I must know. <sighs> what does this mean? Something's <sighs> all that are left unknown. <sighs> What's going on in here? Oh, oh. Lord Ganak, what can I do to help you? Oh, well, uh, I thought I heard someone screaming in here. Uh, uh, uh. You must have heard the voice of a wandering soul. In stormy weather like this, even a soul can lose its way. What on earth are you talking about, Goku? Have you seen anything yet? King Nabusu is quite ancient. Well, I saw a map of hell. A terrifying map covered in blood. Did you say a map of hell? <laughs> it's Shikisu! Are you telling me that the little pirate wench on board the Elchia is that baby? Yes, my lord. The girl pirate is indeed the lost queen of Eja. Oh, I knew that blasted baby wasn't dead. <laughs> I see no reason to be alarmed. Even if that Avra girl is the long-lost queen of Eja, we have nothing to be frightened of. They're just a ragged bunch of thieves who barely know each other. Crystal. Do not underestimate those who have the blood of Daruku in their veins. <laughs> Listen to your father, Crystal. The Queen of Eja herself is the only one who can control God's ship. Queen Era is the chosen one. What? <gasps> Are you saying that that pirate girl is the chosen one, not Prince Ellery? Goku, this isn't the time for any of your stupid tricks. <laughs> Allow me to show you, sire. <gasps> yeah. The golden sword and armor belong to the rightful owner of Arusu's ship. No. She really is the daughter of Daruku. Ah. Be wary. She will soon transform Elchia into a machine of battle for the gods. That coast is clear! There's no sign of the Megaronian fleet! So, what do we do now, Aira? I don't know. I guess we just wait. Something will happen eventually. Does the person huh? who controls Elgia, the ship of God, carry out justice? Or have you already made a pact with evil? Megaronians! <laughs> <laughs> They're Selkies! I don't know if this is justice or evil. We're here to receive the power of the great god Shikisu. What do you want with the power of the great god Shikisu? Do you intend to overwhelm the earth with sorrow once more? Overwhelm the... What are you saying? Do you think we actually want to cause pain to innocent people? Yesterday we witnessed the resurrection of an evil spirit above the sky of Egypt. 
Are you in league with that foul demon? I don't know about any evil spirits. We came to this island because we wanted to. No one forced us. Then why did you free the ancient evil? Many of our people died to imprison it in that ship. Oh. Uh, can he be talking about that big blue creature? Well, someone's in big trouble. I didn't do it! Uh, oh, I did was take the golden crest off the wall, but I didn't free any evil spirits. We will not allow you to remove the seal from the Elchia. Return from whence you came. Wait! Huh? Stop! Man. Oh! We aren't in league with that monster! My father fought against it! He even tried to protect Era using my body! Mm. My father ordered me to protect the Chosen One! He told us to collect the powers of Shikisu, Nod, and Tanoa! That's why we came here! Who is your father? Master Mora! Master Mora? Well, daughter of Mora. So this is the Chosen One. I call on the god Shikisu in the name of the great god Arusu! The time has come! Remove the ancient seal on the ship of god Elchia! Grant her the first power from great god Arusu, the master of fate, protector of the chosen one, god of all! of the three sacred seals has now been removed. Go now and receive the second and third powers at Nod and Tanoa. Hold on a minute. Just exactly what are the three powers that we seek? The first is the power to swim through the water like a fish. The second, the power to fly in the sky like a bird. The third, the power to release fire like a volcano. Why did you hear that? Then we get all three of them macaroni and can kiss their fat butts goodbye! Huh? Huh? Ah. Ah. Go quickly, Chosen One, and make the Elchia complete again! Everyone get below deck quickly! We're oh, driving! Bear, go quickly! Ugh. Please, just tell me one more thing! Why are you so afraid of that monster? The ancient evil will try to... Ah. Ah. Oh. if they get all three powers. The great ship Elchia will soon become unstoppable. No, oh, that can't be! If the Elchia attacks Megaronia, we will be destroyed, just as the Aegean sacred text predicts. Exactly. Just like ancient Hull. <laughs> Not necessarily, fortune teller. Just what are you saying, Crystal? Are you forgetting we have a secret weapon? Secret weapon? That's right. Ellery, the king of Egypt. No, oh, but Lady Crystal, Prince Ellery isn't the chosen one. He's completely without worth to us now. If this Aira girl is indeed the queen of Egypt, then Ellery is her only brother, and he shares her bloodline. Do you really think she would destroy Megaronia along with her own darling brother? Huh. Interesting. Crystal, please, Father, I... I beg of you, please stop this scheming and renounce your evil ways. If we give Prince Ellery back to Eja, Arusu will certainly forgive us. Don't be simple-minded, Sarah. In order for Megaronia to leave its mark on history, we must eliminate all the descendants from Daruku's bloodline. King Nabusu! What do you want? Sire, the enemy ship has been sighted off the coast of Shikisu. 
Well, did you capture it? What about those blasted pirates inside? Well, sire, they vanished into the ocean before we could capture them. They what? Oh, sire, that means... I believe they have received the first power, your majesty. Ganak! <gasps> Issue orders to position all available forces at Tanoa and Nod! Father, grant me permission to go with them. What? I must go with them. I must have that ship. Don't be foolish. We don't know what kind of awesome power that ship will soon possess. But that's exactly why I want to go. We stand a much better chance of capturing that ship now. Finished at last. We've waited countless days for this moment. We should attack the palace at once. With all of Megaronia's armed forces scattered among the islands, we should be able to conquer the country quite easily. <laughs> what would we possibly want with Megaronia? Then why did you order us to build this ship in secret? We wouldn't need the ship to conquer Megaronia. What I want to do is... You want to rule the world. <laughs> Seems we both have the same aspirations, Felgus. <laughs> Lady Crystal, to what do we owe the honor? Give me some credit, Falcus. I've known about your secret little pet project for quite some time. I must commend you for a job well done. It's really quite an impressive ship. Thank you, milady. I'm honored by your praise. However, you're still missing one very vital component. Something you can't do without. <sighs> the ship was built with the best and latest technology. And now you're telling me that something more is needed? Why, yes. Something more powerful than human knowledge. The divine blessing of the gods. Divine blessing? So you're still pining after that rusty old barge? Yes, of course. Commoners are so much dumber than you realize. They fear the divine retribution of the gods more than any sword or machine. Even if you were to torch every last house to a cinder, you would never rule the world. I'm commandeering this vessel. I think with this ship we can capture the mighty Elchia without a problem. I'm so sorry, but I will not allow anyone else to have this ship. <laughs> of King Nabusu's extreme kindness and good favor. You've committed treason against the crown! Gaddock, <laughs> we will be taking this ship to the island of Nod. Prepare to depart. Yes, my lady. What is it, Sarah? Why? Why have you had Felkis arrested? He committed treason and betrayed our country. He must suffer the consequences. You lie! Tell me, why do you harbor such an awful grudge against him? You must really hate him to have ambushed him like that. Ambushed? That's right, ambushed! You knew that Felkis has been secretly laboring over that accursed ship for months. Why didn't you warn him? Why didn't you stop him before it was too late? And I know you both used to be very close when you were young. What happened to you, Crystal? Why is your heart frozen? <laughs> Be silent, Sarah. I know you don't harbor any warm feelings for me either. Isn't that right, my dear sister? You've always hated me because you think I took Falcons away from you, don't you? Don't you, Crystal? <laughs> Tonight, when the moon hangs over the prison, your wish will be granted. If you want the life of your young love spared, then you must go to the prison tonight. Wait, Goku, please! What are you saying? They're funny looking. Yeah, look at them. You scared him away! Idiots! No, What's so amazing about a bunch of fish? Face to the 
Look at them. They've been glued to that portal ever since the ship dove. It's scary to think what they'll be like once we start flying. You think that's bad? That's nothing. Poor Aira has to count on them to fight beside her. Hmm. Is something uh, troubling you, Aira? I can't stop thinking about that evil spirit. Mayard, did your father ever tell you anything about it? Mm-mm. Sarah, what are you- Falcus, please, you've got to hurry! There's no time to lose! Hurry? What? Oh. Huh? Lord Falcus, it looks like all the guards have been slaughtered. What? Lord Falcus, if we hurry and gather our soldiers together, we can take back our ship. Right then, do it. Yes, my lord. Let's go. Right. I beg of you, please, Falcus, take me with you. What are you saying, Sarah? This is far too dangerous for you. I don't care! I don't care, please, Falcus. Take me to the end of the ocean where Macaronia can never reach me. Don't be so impetuous. You have my word, I will come back for you when this is over. Please, wait until then. No, this nation will soon be completely destroyed. Please, I beg you, don't leave me behind. Megaronia is safe. If it is to be destroyed, it will be by my ship and not the ship of God. I've heard that ship already destroyed Hulk once before. I don't believe anyone can stop that horrible ship. I'll stop that hunk of scrap metal, and I'll bring it back to Megaronia for you and everyone to see. Then we'll see who's fit to rule the world. You're scaring me. Capture the Elchia, is that understood? What do you mean? Falcus has escaped? I thought his cell was guarded. All the cell guards were slaughtered, my lady. He must have had a few sympathizers among the soldiers. What did you say? We must secure the harbor immediately. Falcus will try to regain control of his ship. He can't, my lady. We've already closed off the waterway. Lord Felkus, the waterway is completely blocked off. Well, then, we don't want to strain ourselves. Huh? I... There's trouble, sire! The ship is moving! That's impossible! The passageway has been blocked off! But, my lord, they're flying! What did you say? Falcus, my love. Falcus. <laughs> I don't care which ship wins. The ship of God or the ship of Falcus. Are you telling me that you can control either one? Of course. Milady, shall we head toward the Isle of Nod with your young Prince Ellery? 
My dear prophet, this is too good to be true. The strength of your desire and hatred will determine the strength of your belief, my lady. <laughs> my desire and hatred? <laughs> Look, there's a big cluster of round fishies. I wonder if they're yummy. Huh? What do you mean round fishies? We can't eat those! Those are mine! Ah! Right, but even if we get through the fleet, there's no way we can get to the shore. Don't worry, I'll take care of that. All we have to do is meet the Selkie clan and collect the second power, right? You make it sound like a walk in the park, donor. Yeah, donor, what have you been smoking? Don't you remember that we also have a fighter plane? God, you don't mean the one we stole from Crystal's ship? Yeah. Donor, uh. I'll go with you. It's better if I talk to the Selkie clan. All right, kiddo, I'm counting on you. Keep them busy, okay? God Arusu came down from the heavens. Arusu created the Great Eagle and the limitless Great Sea. The Great Eagle turned on and attacked its creator. The fingers of Arusu fell into the Great Sea and became the islands of the four gods. Where did that come from? Hmm. 
They're antiquated gods. They're no match against modern technology. Obliterate them. What about the Megaronian fleet, my lord? With this ship and its great power, we will create a new legend where intelligence reigns supreme. Surrender to that monstrosity. Crash dive! Oh, oh it's so oh. shallow! Hey, the ship is Hey, driving. wait for us, Era! This is the all-powerful ship of God. What a joke. Let's finish them. Hmm? the second power to the Elchia and the Chosen One. Glory be! The ship is flying! <laughs> In your face! I don't know about that other ship, but God definitely likes us today. Mayor, fly to Tanoa quickly and break the third and final seal. Right. Come on, Donor, let's go! What? Right! Ah! Let's go. You half-wits! Don't let yourselves be fooled by childish illusions. Open fire on those blasted selfies! Ah! My lady. <laughs> Watch your tone, Prophet. Please, forgive my rudeness. It doesn't really matter which ship wins. We can capture either one. But even if we are capable of capturing the legendary Elchia, we don't have any way of controlling it now, do we? <sighs> so you want to be the chosen one as well? What's wrong with that? Uh, I'm sorry, but... The Chosen One is inherent. 
only to the royal family of Yija, even you, dear lady. Can Tell answer. me, is there anyone else besides Aero who can pilot the ship? <sighs> it's a distinct possibility. Are you saying there's another who possesses the powers of the Chosen One? Yes. That same person would very much like to be your ally. Must Sarah stay in that musty cargo hold? Why don't you take her to Prince Ellery's cell? I am sure he would enjoy the company. Yes, Lord Google. Please, my lord, don't tell Lady Crystal about this. Of course, my dear. <gasps> Lady Sarah, follow me! What kind of ship is that? It's even faster than the Elchia! Elchia, dive! Can run, but there will be no escape. <laughs> if a ship that decrepit and slow is worshipped by the commoners, then my ship will surpass the very gods themselves. That girl, Era, is my sister? That's right. Just as my father was conquering Ija, your sister, Era, was born. My father said a nursemaid escaped with the baby, and they were never able to find either one of them. Lana. But you still haven't explained to me what you're doing here. <laughs> Lady Sarah stowed away on board because she wants to end the conflict between Lord Felcus and Lady Crystal before it's too late. Conflict? It's all that awful ship's fault. My big sister and Lord Felcus are fighting because they both want to control the ship of God and use it to rule the world. So they're still after the Elchia. It's even worse than that. There's no way they can defeat it. The Elchia is being piloted by the Chosen One, just like the prophecy predicted. But wait! Just who is the Chosen One? Well, Crystal always thought that you were the legendary Chosen One. But as it turns out, your sister Era really is. Oh. Era is the Chosen One. Hello, dear lady. What can I do for you? Cuckoo. Let's go somewhere quiet and finish our previous conversation. <laughs> Tell me, what are the terms of the person who wants to become my ally? Terms? That person might not ask for anything at all. But if you were to join up with that person, you must have a lot of determination. It won't be easy. What kind of determination? Determination to sacrifice your father, your sister, and even your lover. You must want to conquer and completely subjugate countries you've never even heard of. You must be willing to deny mercy and compassion for all other human beings. Do you have that kind of determination? Dear God, you're not Goku, are you? Have we not been previously introduced? Good. They're chipping away at us bit by bit. Blast it! Hey, custard head! How far are we from Shikisu? Uh, We're under 20 feet of water! How the heck would I know? Well, why don't you try doing your job instead of making up excuses? Why don't you try not being a moron for a change? What? Say that again, you little stinking boy like uh, uh, You two settle down? Era, what are we gonna do? If we keep this up, we'll end up as fish food. We can't just stand here, we're gonna have to do something. I know. We'll have to try taking an offensive tact. <laughs> the ship has stopped moving, sir. What? What is it? 
They probably think we can't see them behind that rock, but we'll flush them out, my lord. Come out and fight us, you cowards! Huh? This is strange, sir. Huh? The ship is moving. And it's coming closer to us. What? Get us out of here, now! Go after them! Don't just sit there, Era! Get us out of here! It's not my fault! The ship won't move! What do you mean it won't move? That means that... We're gonna die. Uh, 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 you guys, uh, is it time for dinner yet? Moron! Lady Crystal, we spotted the ships. It seems as if Focus's ship has won. Oh, it's not over <gasps> yet. The mighty ship of God has yet to receive the legendary third power. That means we should be able to take both ships quite easily. Oh, I knew I made a good decision when I chose you. So you have found your determination? <laughs> Bring Prince Ellery. Bring young Sarah as well. Sarah? What is she doing on the ship? Apparently, she was worried about you and Felcus, so she stowed away on board. Why didn't you tell me about this? I just couldn't afford to let your determination weaken, my lady. You deceived me. I think that's enough for now. Yes, Lord. Lord Felcus, the flagship is approaching. Mm -hmm. Elkis, you can cease your attack. I'll take care of the details. Sarah. Ellery! If you value Sarah's life, surrender your ship. You don't really mean that, Crystal. You wouldn't really kill me over that ship. Do it, Felkis! Prepare the gangplank. Lord Felkis, are you really going to surrender our ship to that conniving bitch? Don't be so simple-minded. I must say, I hadn't expected you to surrender. I thought for sure you'd choose that ship over Sarah. After all, that's what you did to me. Some things are worth more than others. Please, stop all this pointless quarreling! Why does it have to be like this? Why can't you be allies like you used to be? What happened to you? <coughs> what happened to you? What do you think happened? You stole Fergus away from me, and now look where we are. I knew that was what this was about. Guards, seize Lord Felcus! Oi! Sarah, come with me. Yes, my love. And so I sever our final bond. <clears throat> <laughs> no! You shouldn't have been so short-sighted, Falcus. You should have realized that I know you better than anyone and can anticipate your every move. Sarah, come with me. I'm right here. Stop, Sarah. I will shoot you, you know. Huh? <gasps> Embark for far away countries. 
Sarah. Leave me. Destroy everything! Create a new legend written in blood! has been resurrected in return to its form of glory. What could you possibly do, young prince, even if you were on the deck of Elchia itself? What do you mean? Who would accept someone like you as king of Eja? Someone who had been nothing but a disgrace, and who could save no one? Even the great god Arusu deserted you and placed his faith in another chosen one. Be silent! Please stop me, <gasps> brother! Let's go, Mayor! Mayor, take heed. The odious smell of evil surrounds the ship of God. Be always on your guard. What is it, Master? The Chosen One who sold his heart to evil. Another Chosen One? Well, Big Brother, let me introduce you to the crew. Donor and Funk, you know Mayard, right? And this is Flack, Shiru, Nira, and Nooper. Who's that guy with Nira? Ah! You dummy! Haven't you been paying attention? He's the king of Eja, our lost king. What? Must have picked out his brains! <laughs> <laughs> so, Era, what do we do now? We've saved King Ellery, so we did everything we were supposed to do, right? Yeah, I guess so. Why don't we set course back to Eja? Hey, wait, Aira! I thought we were gonna attack Magaronia. You know, vengeance is ours and all that crap. Let's go kick some butt! With this ship, we could pound them to a bloody pulp! Ah, you know it, baby! <laughs> and besides, we got Chris Dahl shackled to a wall down there! <laughs> Listen up, you morons. None of us has the right to decide where to take the Elgia next. Aira is the only one who can control the ship. And besides, the King of Egypt is here, too. Oh, hell yeah. That's right! So, Big Brother, what should we do? I have no right to decide for you. Of course you do, Ellery. You're the true King of Egypt. I need to rest for a while. I'm very tired. Uh, uh... Of course! Uh, someone show him to his room! I'll do it. Right this way. Do you still want to go back to Egypt? Mm. Too many people have lost their lives for this cursed ship. I think we've all seen enough death. Mm. 
Thank you, Mayor. Sure. <laughs> what can I do for you? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> A sulky so young can be of no threat. Are you having trouble sleeping, Master Ellery? I was just thinking how pointless my life has been. What does that matter? You're starting a brand new life now alongside your little sister. The past should just be forgotten. Yes, but can I become a good king? Of course you can! Daruku's blood runs in your veins! Then why am I not the chosen one? <gasps> Where are you going, Master Ellery? I'm going for a walk. <sighs> well, big brother, I still don't feel right. Don't you want to be a strong king? Aren't you angry that the great god Rusu deserted you and chose Era over you? What do you want? Join me, Ellery. Only I can give you the awesome powers befitting a king of Ija. <laughs> what garbage. <laughs> the owner of that skull is the man who destroyed ancient Hulk. He would also like to bestow this power upon you. That was the Chosen One from the sacred text of Asia. That's right, Ellery. Take the Golden Sword, symbol of the Chosen One. Become the Chosen One, as is fitting for the King of Asia. <laughs> Come, Ellery, fulfill your birthright and take your rightful place. What's happening? I have given the huh? order. The great god Arusu was angered by Megaronia's expansion. That is why he sent the Eltia. It's time to teach them a lesson and show them the wrath of God. I, Ellery, king of Ija, will conquer Megaronia as the chosen one. So, now Ellery is the chosen one? There can be only one true chosen one, and that's Era. Then watch and see. Only the true Chosen One can control the actions of the Eltia. Burn it all to the ground! <laughs> well, that was a rather impressive display. Now we all know who is really in charge. Stop it, big brother! I don't care about that! We've got to end this destruction! Elchia, hold your fire! Oh. And you hold your tongue, Era. I am in charge. Ellery, 
I commend you, King of Eja. Lady Crystal, the time has come for us to embark for faraway countries. What is she talking about, Ellery? That's not him. It's the ancient evil. Ancient evil? It was the Selkie clan who made me become an evil soul. One thousand years ago, I was declared the Chosen One, and I was sealed alive inside the Elchia. I promised myself in the darkness of my prison that one day I would exact revenge on the Selkie clan at any price, even if it meant I must become a demon of hell. You were sealed away because you made a pact with darkness! And yet, can you truly say that I've done anything wrong? Are you saying that using the Elchia to unite the world under one leader is evil? And now, the time has come to carry out my revenge by staining the very soil red. Transform the world into a sea of fire! Oh, great good heavens, King Nabusu! Now what is it, Ganek? It's the Elchia, sire. The ship of God has landed on our shore. Huh? What did you say? We can't possibly stop it. We've got to get out of here. Please, my lord, hurry! Wait. Perhaps Crystal has captured the Elchia and brought it back home. What are you saying, your majesty? Why would Lady Crystal attack her own kingdom? <laughs> huh? We're being attacked? But what has happened to Crystal and Sarah? Say you love the smell of fire gel. <laughs> Please stop this, Lady Crystal. If you continue, both the Royal Palace and King Nabusu will be. You are nothing but a wretched servant. Be silent. <laughs> Ellery dies? Don't you understand? I now reside in the body of young Prince Ellery. If you want to destroy me, you must kill your own brother. What? Do you have a heart to slaughter your brother, Era? <sighs> <laughs> if you want to stop the Elchia, go ahead and kill Ellery! <laughs> Era! Huh? I will force the evil soul out of him! Kill Ellery! Hurry! Do it now! 
Don't you realize I am a soul? You think you can kill a spirit with a sword? Forgive me, Era. Because I harbor the seed of darkness in my heart, the ancient evil was able to take root there and control me. Big Brother! You have to kill me, Era. It's the only way. But I can't. Do it, Era. If I'm not killed, the Earth will be thrust into eternal darkness once more. How could I possibly do that? You're my only family. Look out! We're gonna collide! Stop your movement, Algia! Die now, chosen one! Out of the way, Mayard! Forgive me, Era! Forgive your stupid brother!
Don't you stand there, honey. <laughs> you're pathetic. Hey, Noopa, you're supposed to be the man of the family. So why don't you try to act like one? Hold your tongue, Funk. You know that women have always reigned supreme on this vessel. Ah, wanna bet? Don't even think about it, Funk. Not unless you feel like going for a little dip in the briny deep. Try what? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Aira! There's a merchant ship, and it looks like it's really loaded down! Well spotted, Black! <sighs> All right, everyone, get ready! Aye. The ship, because it is unguarded, will always try to tempt evil into the Chosen One's heart. Once that heart turns to evil, the Earth will return to eternal darkness. Ta-da!